Hi everybody, I'm Eugenio Tacchini, founder and main developer of Databee. I'm here to present to you Databee 8 Lerici. This release is the biggest improvement we have ever made to Databee since its creation in 2001. Yes, last November, Databee turned 15. Since its first release, 67 versions have been published, and Databee has reached a popularity that I could have never imagined. The basic concept is still the same. You can build a complete web database application without any coding. If you know some PHP, even better, because you can also add your own custom code to customize even more the application. So, I will show you just the most important improvements in Databeak 8. You can see the complete list in the change log, and you have a link in the description of this video. Okay, let's start! First of all, we have a completely new front-end graphic layout, with four themes and two different menu options, left side menu or top drop-down menu. The layout finally is responsive, so as you can see, it looks great even on the small screen of your smartphone. And you have now two display options for the results grid. The classic grid and the list, which works way better on small screens. Chart reports has been a long-awaited feature. You have now a complete reporting tool that allows you to create pie charts, line charts, bar charts based on your data. You have the simple reporting tool, which can be used to create a graph very easily. You just choose how to aggregate data and what to show for each group. For example here, starting from my orders, I want to see how many orders I got monthly. x-axis month date order, y-axis count. Here we go. The advanced SQL report allows you to create a chart based on a custom SQL query. For example, using this query, I get the monthly revenue, using data which are spread across three different tables. The new Smart Installation procedure allows to save a lot of time during the Databeak application configuration. Databeak tries to guess the correct parameters for a field according to database field type and constraints. For example, if you have a referential integrity constraint in your schema, Databeak automatically chooses a lookup field type for the foreign key and set the correct linked fields. Even the field name is considered, so if your field name contains the word email, for example, email contact, Databeak sets the field content to email and therefore will only accept valid email for that field. With hooks, you can write a custom PHP function to be called when something happens. We have for each table in your database, after insert, before update, after update, and after delete hooks. For example, you can easily add some code that when a new order is registered into your system, and this would be an after insert hook in the table orders, automatically updates your stock in a table warehouse. So it is actually similar to a database trigger, but it's at the application level and you can write your own PHP code. What is a calculated field? You are probably familiar with that. It's a field whose value is not directly provided by the user, but calculated according to a custom PHP function. For example, you might have a total price field which needs to be calculated according to the values of other fields, price plus tax. In addition to pages, 
based on tables or views and custom HTML and PHP pages, you now have a new page type, links. Very simple, allows you to add a custom link internal to the application or external to the menu. This is particularly useful when you create a graph report and you want to easily access it later from the menu, in one click. For example, here I created a link page and as a URL, I set the one generated by the chart reporting tool so that I can easily access the chart in one click without rebuilding the report. For the pictures you upload, you can now specify in the configuration file for results grid and details page the maximum width and height in pixels. Typically, you want a thumbnail in the results grid and a larger picture in the details page. The admin section has been drastically improved. The idea was to reduce as much as possible the development and configuration time. I'll tell you just a few things. The tables inclusion page, which is now called Pages, has been completely redesigned and allows now to handle all the settings related to database pages. Pages based on tables, on views or custom pages. It is also possible to create database views directly from this page. The usability of the form configurator has been improved a lot. For example, when you set a lookup field, primary key, linked fields and other fields are now chosen from a list, without the need of typing field names manually. Furthermore, it is now possible to copy form settings from one table to another in one click. A copy feature has been added to the Permissions Manager too, and it allows to copy the permissions from one group to another, choosing a specific table. And that's it, so have fun! Visit databic.com to try our online demo and to buy your license. Bye-bye.